Russia's getting another Project 68 uh, light cruiser, and this one's going to be a modernized up one with the latest goodies. Good evening. I am Old Dead Man, your host. Welcome to War Thunder's website. Glad to be here today. They uh, they announced the another vehicle for the upcoming patch. The I'm, I'm bear with my pronunciation here, which is certain to be incorrect. The Mikhail Kutuzov. And uh, this is a, a had a little, a little bit of interesting uh, history on this one, but the ship itself looks like it doesn't have really much service history behind it. But the person it's named after is a bit interesting. Might be worth some research later. So let's take a closer look at what we've got here. The Mikhail Kutuzov was a Soviet light cruiser of the Project 68 BIS line designed and built by the Soviet Navy. He, by the way, according to my research, Russian ships are male, not female, like I'm used to with the U.S. and other similar Western nations. Uh, so he was named after Prince Mikhail Ilarionovich Golanishev Kutuzov, who served as a field marshal, military officer, and diplomat in the 18th and early 19th century. He is known for defeating Napoleon in the Patriotic War of 1812. The cruiser that bears his name, though, was laid down in 1951 and commissioned in 1954. It was then immediately placed in the Black Sea Fleet. Modernization carried out in 1970 reduced the crew, but modernized radar systems, added high fire rate 30 millimeter air defense cannon, and buffed the communications systems, while also removing the torpedo tubes. He was stricken from the register in 2001 and began new life as a museum ship in 2002. He remains moored in Novorossiysk as a branch of the Central Naval Museum. The Mikhail Kutuzov is 210 meters long, 22 meters a beam, 6.9 meters draft, and weighs in at 13,600 long ton standard displacement. Big fella. Her six boilers drive two steam turbines for a maximum speed of 32 and a half knots. Original armaments include 12 152 millimeter guns and triple turrets, 12 100 millimeter guns and twin mounts, 32 37 millimeter AA guns and twin mounts, and 10 533 millimeter torpedo tubes in quintuple mounts. Armor for her class was eh, decent. With 100 millimeter belt armor, 150 millimeters on the conning tower, 50 millimeter deck armor, 175 millimeters on the turret fronts, and 130 millimeter on the barbettes. He was crewed by 1,250 men before modernization. But let's take a look at what it's going to look like in game. In War Thunder, the Mikhail Kutuzov will be joining the Russian Rank 5 Blue Water Fleet in her final modernization form, you know, transform rollout into the latest form, with the torpedo tubes removed and eight twin barreled 30 millimeter AK 230 mounts installed for air defense. He will also be crewed by only 1,057 men. Now, my thoughts on this one I think it'll be a lot of fun for Russian captains to, uh, to have a a nice light cruiser to go with. Plus it has that historic connection, which always makes me smile. Uh, but uh, she's not going to stand up well into the pummeling of a modern battleship. So be prepared. I expect her to be a little bit more agile than, than many other ships in this area. And I'm already familiar. I think for most uh, players that play Naval, as uh, there are, I believe, a couple other cruisers that are already in the game that are of similar design. This one's just a modern version. Let me know what you think in the comments below. Give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. You have a great rest of your day. And hey, we'll see you floating around on the waves of War Thunder. The Mikhail Kutuz Kutuzov. Kutuzov. Prince Mikhail Il Il Mikhail Il Il He was named after Prince Mikhail Ilarionovich Goli Golinishov Kutuzov Kutuzov Prince Mikhail Il Il He is known for defeating Napoleon in the Patriotic War of eighteen of yeah, that's 1812, not 1912.